everything going so badly in Europe, I'm sure Trump longs for the days of his summit with North Korean dictator Kim Jong-un. Remember? No more nukes. You can sleep safe. Alan Alda, you can come home. Your work is done. <laughs> well, last week, North Korea got a follow-up visit from Secretary of State and younger Kevin James, Mike Pompeo. <laughs> And now we're getting reports that Pompeo's North Korea meeting went as badly as it could have gone. I'm not surprised. Sometimes the second date is rough. <laughs> you go back to his place, you find out it's full of executed relatives, or worse, <laughs> Limp Biscuit CDs. <laughs> it didn't seem like North Korea was taking the summit that seriously from the very start. Pompeo thought he'd be put up in a nice hotel. But instead, the North Koreans put him up in a gated guest house just behind the mausoleum where the bodies of regime founders Kim Il sung and his son Kim Jong Il lie embalmed. Or as Airbnb described it, cozy bungalow, quiet neighbors, great view of dictator corpses. Another. Sure. Sure. The A's are stuff to go. Another reason Pompeo didn't have a good meeting with Kim Jong-un, he didn't meet with Kim Jong-un. <laughs> but Kim had a very good excuse. Turns out he was too busy visiting a potato farm <laughs> to meet with the U.S. Secretary of State. But to be fair, a lot of people have trouble telling the difference between Mike Pompeo and a potato. <laughs> you say, you say potato, I say Pompeo, potato, Pompeo, let's call the nuke deal off. And the saddest part of all of this is that Donald Trump is president, but also sad. <laughs> but also sad, Mike Pompeo had a gift for Kim that he never got to deliver. Remember when Donald Trump was threatening to blow up the world and calling Kim Jong-un little racket man? <laughs> well, he thought it would be fun to send Pompeo with an Elton John CD with the song Rocket Man, and the CD is signed. It's not signed by Elton John. It's signed by President Trump. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, dear Kim, I didn't write this. But I did listen to it, put it on to remember that time I insulted your penis. <laughs> Stay sweet, have a great summer, Don. 